Hey everybody, and welcome to my next edition of XCOM Enemy Within Let's Play. I am Omni Rusted. Now, the last mission did not go well at all, but Raz Menton actually earned the Defender's Medal, and I'm going to give it to her. Because, well, she's got actually pretty low will, so the never panicking, I just know, is going to come into effect. Plus, at this point, she's my only upgraded unwounded. God, those eyebrows. Here. Let's go back and view our soldiers here. We've got Chaos Mage, who is still in... Who's still five five days wounded, which five days isn't bad. And we're going to have to be putting some more people up and upgrading them. So once they get upgraded to an actual class, then I will upgrade them with actual names. If they don't live long enough to actually get a class, they don't deserve names. Let's just say that. Huh. Oh. I actually got the meld recombination going on now. Or the research for it so, anyway. What is it, Doctor? It's fancy. It's like it's a Christmas ornament. Remarkable. The crystalline structure housed within the canister is actually a suspension containing billions of cybernetic nanomachines, each made up of both organic and mechanical components. My team's analysis indicates these microscopic robots are capable of assembling mechanical structures with unprecedented efficiency. With further study and some specialized facilities, we may be able to engineer a sort of cyber suit that interfaces with the human body. I pray. My team is more interested in the possibility of physically altering the tissue itself, incorporating aspects of the alien's own genetic adaptations by using the nanites to fuse the foreign material. That was a the commander will have to decide where the greatest advantage lies. Is there anything you agree on? Given the apparent purpose of the nanites, they allow combining organic materials with one another, or with machines. We have at least agreed to call them... Meld. Neat. And back to weapons fragments. Back to the mission... Back to scanning while staring at Africa. Oh, hey, Chaos Mage is returned to duty. Oh, goody. That completed fast. We get the scope. The scope is very nice. I'm gonna do a alien materials next because I armor. Well, be a priority research task, Commander. Because everybody is dying. You heartless bitch. Oh, hey, Commander, abduction site. Where are we going next? Several reported abductions via the hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. Ooh, the sergeant. In Egypt, which I've already got Egypt. But a new sergeant would be really useful. And it's a support. Yeah, I need some troops to keep everybody going. Because all I've got now is just Chaos Mage and Raz and rookies. Rookies, rookies, rookies. Oh, I forgot to build scopes. Damn it. Oh well. The rookies are getting medkits and they're just gonna follow along. Keep you guys alive. I hope, I hope, I hope. Okay, Operation Broken We're just inside the Egyptian in border. Alexandria, Egypt. This Alien looks like another unfamiliar map. Wow. That's a new drop sequence. Nice, I like it. Central, this is Big Sky. Okay. Down now. Looks like. Roger, Big Sky. That's a lot of Reading TVs. Who needs that many Strike TVs? The green light for deployment. Are we gonna head straight into the building, or are we gonna try? It doesn't look, doesn't look like there's large cover outside there, but there is a meld, and I do need to go for the meld. So we're gonna take this carefully. Wow! Right away. Hi guys. Your alien asses. here. Now this is going to make me a little bit vulnerable to the inside of the building, but I think we're okay. Yep. In fact, we have a flanking shot. Damn it. Ugh. Okay. Hopefully 
Hopefully if any come around this corner it will be set for them. Moving to position. Oh yeah, I need to actually check what their new stats are. Oh. Oh, we got some overwatch shots. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn. I knew I should have. Ah, I'm really regretting not getting those scopes now. Where are you going? Ah, missed me. But you know what? I hate everything about you guys. Uh, should, I, should I? You know what? Rocket Launcher is too useful, and he can probably hit them both. Yep, he can hit them both, so... Let's just destroy every bit of cover between here and there. But it's worth it to take out two guys. And get to that meld as fast as possible. Hey, and hey, I got an idea. Let's send in the rookies. be safe at the back of that car. I think. Already there. I'll listen in the other rookie just in case. Don't worry guys, I'll be keeping an eye on you. Okay. Oh. Okay. I am Bears. See, again, this is why I don't like the new meld thing, which I'm not even going to reach that crap now. Because it encourages running and gunning, and running and gunning is not how you play XCOM. You, if you want to keep your squad members, you're cautious the whole damn time. That's how you play XCOM. That's how it's supposed to work. Running and gunning just upsets me. And gets poor little rookies killed. Okay. Yeah, screw the meld. I don't even need it right now. And take things cautiously. Because I don't want to lose more squad members. And I'm not even going to get to that meld anyway. Yeah, there's no way in hell I'm going to reach it. Stay on that sectoid. I'm just gonna watch the inside of the building. We're going to move slowly. Mm, yeah, and there goes the meld. But oh well. It's better than the alternative, which is getting more of my people killed. I'm on it, Commander. Now, admittedly, when I say get more of my people killed, I mean, I, I know that was totally Heading my to fault. Clear to engage. Oh, crap. And we gotta watch the rookies because they're the ones with the medkits. Okay, so I'm not gonna do this, I'm just gonna straight That's pull back. on top of that building, which is not going to be friendly. <sighs> and I swear, if you shoot through that thin stucco wall and... What? Oh, crap. Oh, come on. You guys are on Overwatch. How are you not shooting anything? They're moving to flank me. Well, that's really too bad for them, isn't it?
Let's go support the rookie. Oh, I shouldn't have sent out there alone. No shot. But a shot worth taking anyway. Oh hey, we actually hit him. Didn't kill him, you know, but can't have everything, I guess. Hmm. You know, let's just let's just Yeah, let's stay on Overwatch. God. Now I'm just getting nervous about losing people. This is what happens when you name them after friends. Are you kidding me? Oh, and you're panicking again. And you're not even a good shot. Why are you even here? I'm worried this one over here is on Overwatch, so I'm just gonna come out here and sit this direction. Now, can you finish the job, or are you gonna continue to miss? Nope. Of course, the other one is panicking behind no cover, so was gonna die. Well, so much for rookies. I am just not good with rookies, but at least these ones didn't have names, so I was not attached to them. That's. Well, to me, that's what's important. Now, you're still behind full cover. I want to get you into a better position because I just do not trust this game right now. It is not being nice to me. Eh, you know what? Take the shot. Yep, you got a kill. Okay. It's starting to even the odds a little bit. Not by much. I just lost both meld. Damn. This game is just not liking me at all. I'm just going to plane, yes, run up here, get shot at by Overwatch. Well, at least you won't panic. And nobody is shooting this round. Nobody is on Overwatch. We're just sort of really, really vulnerable There's with my two best there. people. Okay. I knew he was going to be on Overwatch, too. We lost both the melds, so we can now take our time and just sit here and hope they come to us. Which, generally, eventually they will. Because they know where we are. They know where both of us are. Hopefully I can draw them out. Well, that guy is staying there in Overwatch, because he's a dick. You know what? Coming out here is a risk. Probably on Overwatch. Let's take it. Nothing. That's actually a surprise. Means I'll probably move out of Overwatch, but and you know shoot my ass. But On hey, we'll do what we can. Hopefully, if they come out of o hopefully if it comes out of Overwatch and has to move into position, then I can actually shoot him down. Nope, nothing. We use the healthier member of the team. Two directions. This is not making me very happy. There you are, you son of a bitch. There, there's another down. One direction covered. Whew, only two men left. What's making that noise? Let's get you back behind the cover.
let's just keep safe. Oh wait, I could have gone on the roof. Damn it, there's an access there. Didn't even see that. Well, let's put you on the watch for now and do that next turn. Alright, we're just gonna run and gun you straight onto the roof. In case he's up there and in overwatch, we're gonna try and go for full cover. Oh, looks like it's all clear. Scout around just so you don't get hurt again. Oh, well, apparently he's still around that corner. In that case. Roger Dodger. Let's see if we can flank this asshole. visual. And I know he's got to be right around that corner. Let's see if we can blow up this section of the building. Stuck on this. Destroy some of his cover here. Or him. I just don't like this mission. It's just not going well. well let's just use this top section here to explore just a little bit more since we can get a good vantage. And the pigeons do not give a shit. You hear that? Well, apparently they're in there. Hmm. Which could mean this section here or this section here. In either case, I just don't like it. Moving out. Good to go. So we're going to keep an eye on it from up here, while moving her into position. Yes, sir. At least one person protecting you. Hmm. While that building burns down over there. And they've moved. Ugh. Well, hopefully, at least we can get some kind of flanking going here. Oh, way the fuck over there. That's wunderbar. How did... How did you even see them? There's no... I don't, I don't understand. Well, we're gonna send you into a flanking position, and because he's full health, we're gonna send him... We're going to send him straight up the building. And into cover. Hopefully they haven't seen me yet. Although I'm pretty sure I'm not that lucky. I don't know if there's anything in here. Okay. Nope, it looks clear. Of course, there's the other meld I didn't get. So they're still down there. But if they're still moving around, I've got to get her out there fast. Or he's just going to take them all out himself. Which isn't necessarily bad, just isn't necessarily what I wanted. And 
and I see nothing. But I've got a good look down there. So let's just wait for her to come around and take a look. There's both of them. Okay. Well, we don't have explosives. So there's not much I can do, but I do know where they are. So I can at least run up to here. Okay, now can we get... You know, he might be able to actually get a kill with the running gun. Let's risk it. And nobody is on Overwatch. Yes. Hi there. Are you kidding me? It's a machine gun. Of course you're going to shoot at the wounded one. Oh well. Didn't kill her. That's what's important. I'm going to give this a shot again. There. Okay, actually down. We're gonna keep the full cover and we're gonna keep on Overwatch just in case that son of a bitch moves. That's right. Come on, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. No, see, how you hit sectoids is you aim the barrel towards them. I know this is a weird, unfamiliar concept, but you aim towards them. Towards them. Not... You know what? Here, just let me show you how it's done. Firing rocket. Kind of like that. Chuck up another one. <sighs> that was a really horrible, horrible mission. Thanks for watching. Hopefully next time is better.